guys, um, so as you may or may not know, I recently bought the L'Oreal Paris Nude Magique CC Cream in both the green and the apricot. And before I went and used them all, I was like, I should show people what these things actually can do. So what I'm going to do today is like a side by side comparison. Um, so this is me kind of without anything on. I have moisturised and I have like put a little bit of primer on but as you can see I'm not having the best day kind of facially. So I'm going to start with the uh, so I'm going to start with the kind of orange one because this is the one I haven't actually used before. Um, and so what this one is supposed to do is like wake up your complexion um, so I will start with this one because I'm likely to keep the green one on rather than the apricot one um, let's go as you can see it's quite orange and then we're just going to apply them all So as you can see, all it did was make me slightly orange <laughs> in certain places. Um, I mean, it doesn't look too bad on camera, but like in real life, I think you can tell. I've got some foundation-y product on. Um, maybe that's because my skin wasn't as dull as it needed to be for this to work. But, you know, I'm not really sure how I feel about the orange one. Um, like, it looks alright on camera from the bits where it's really obviously apricot. So that's what the apricot one does. It doesn't really do any kind of red neutralising. So you can still see like the my little scab I've got here, my little scab I've got up here. So that's the apricot one. I mean, I think if your skin is more discoloured and tired than mine is, it might be alright. But mine is quite like, just red. So it's like, not really the product for me. So, time to get rid of it. So I have taken off the apricot one now. And as you can see, I'm kind of red down here. So this green one should hopefully do a better job of kind of neutralising areas um, because green is the opposite to red. Colour theory!
this one has done a far better job of neutralizing kind of the red that I had on my chin it's not quite as noticeable now and has given me enough coverage so I would just put concealer on top and like blend it out and be fine um, I think for the majority of people that the, especially the green where it doesn't the foundation isn't quite as strong in this one I think the green one is probably better for most normal people um, and I think the, you would have to be really careful to use the apricot one um, I definitely don't feel like it gives you the kind of natural coverage of this one um, it's definitely more of a kind of if your skin is kind of deathly blue I'd use this one but if you just have kind of strange blemishy uneven pigmentation from your rosa carter like I do then this is or rosacea this is the one for you um, when I compare the two side by side you can clearly see that the orange one is just the wrong colour the foundation in it is too dark <laughs> and it might be okay if I mixed it with like my custom cover drops but that kind of defeats the point of using a CC cream if you're just going to mix it with something else so if I could go back in time I would only buy the green one but because I already have the orange one I will probably gift it on and give it to someone else someone whose skin is a bit more deathly than mine <laughs> or who has a darker complexion to begin with um, that would be great for them this was just a little rundown of what these two actually look like on skin um, and I will see you soon.